The best way to describe Penske Racing's Brad Kozlowski? How about Mr. Consistency? Kozlowski took part Sunday in the NASCAR Sprint Cup Series Pure Michigan 400 at what he calls his home track, Michigan International Speedway, and earned a second place finish behind the wheel of his number two Miller Lite Dodge Charger, less than a half second behind winner Greg Biffle. It was Kozlowski's seventh consecutive top ten finish and his ninth top five in 23 races. He remains fifth in the series championship standings, 19 points behind fourth place Jimmy Johnson and 13 ahead of sixth place Martin Truax Jr. He trails leader Biffle by 47. Teammate Sam Hornish Jr. in the number 22 Shell Pennzoil Dodge Charger finished 12th. Hornish started 41st in the 43 car field. He didn't practice or qualify the car because of nationwide commitments in Montreal. And he worked his way through the pack. He led the race three times for nine laps, the first time he has led in seven cup starts this season. He also got the official nod from team owner Roger Penske that he will be behind the wheel of the number 22 Dodge next week at Bristol Motor Speedway. Dodge was the class of the field in Saturday's NASCAR Nationwide Series Napa 200 at the 2.709 mile paved road course in Montreal with two podium finishes in a wild overtime affair. Pit strategy was the key for the well-prepared Penske Dodges as they showed their road course strength. Hornish finished second and Jacques Villeneuve took third place, both utilizing incredible fuel mileage and overcoming three cautions over the final nine laps in a fender-banging race that included two green-white checkered restarts to determine the race winner. SRT Motorsports Team Viper is celebrating another top 10 finish in American Le Mans Series competition. The number 91 Forza Motorsports Viper GTSR team of Kuno Whitmer and Dominic Farnbacher finished 9th. The number 93 Pennzoil Ultra Viper driven by Tommy Kendall and Mark Goosens placed 13th and did not finish the four-hour race after crashing into a wall about midway through the competition. Team Viper was making only its second ALMS start in its return to competition in the GT class. The debut came two weeks ago at Mid-Ohio, where the number 91 team of Whitmer and Farnbacher finished 10th. Team Mopar NHRA Full Throttle Drag Racing Series Pro Stock Driver Alan Johnson advanced to the final round on Sunday in the Lucas Oil Nationals at Brainerd International Raceway in Minnesota, which marked his sixth final round appearance this season. Ron Caps was victorious at Brainerd in Funny Car in his Mopar-powered Dodge Charger RT for Don Schumacher Racing. For this week in motorsports, I'm Pete Misiak.